It's our outfit pie show. It's our outfit pie show. We love Gordon Bryan. It's our outfit pie show. Yeah, it's Gordon. My last name's Brian. Brian. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez, that was a ripper. Uh, g'day, it's the Off Air Podcast. I'm Liam. We've got Ben over there. Present. Bell's here. Hello. And producer Andy. Present. Um, this is, yeah, where we talk all things off air, behind the scenes. You know, we do like a, a Saturday show in Adelaide and Melbourne as well. It's all like replays, like favourite bits from the week and whatnot. And we had uh, Jerry Springer's producer on. You might have heard it in the podcast. Good so we, chat. Yeah, it was great. Mm-hmm. And obviously, because, you know, he died on like today, like Friday, for a Saturday show, we have to do like pickups to be like, yesterday he died and, you know, so it all sort of works. And Ben was having a little bit of a mare before, wasn't he, Bell? I think we got. I would say I was having a mare. Well, you, you know, We're all Ben we, moment. We, we, we told you what you had to say, so then it would set up properly, and and you weren't quite getting the message. Yesterday we spoke to one of Jerry Springer's producers. Oh, yesterday, yesterday we found out he died. Yeah, what I say? We you spoke to a producer, and it's just yesterday we oh, found yeah, out. Sorry, Jerry yeah, Springer yeah, yeah. Hey, yesterday we found out that Jerry Springer's producer <laughs> died. <laughs> Did you guys hear that Jerry Springer's producer died? <laughs> 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 yeah, I, I struggle to get my head around it. It's at the end of a week. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, I know I won't. I won't deduct any points off of your week. Yeah, yeah I, won't, I won't be a giving. You a, oh, there's no way I that's, would, a strike. that's a strike. Oh, I think it was like a funny mistake. I think. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, like, I think well, it's a strike. A strike mistake probably. can be funny. Oh, I, well, I would say you know with like. It's a, re- a retrospective strike is sort of like I think that's a bit crummy. Like if you if I dealt it at the moment, I don't yeah. think anyone would have blinked an eyelid. Yeah, but, you know, I, I agree. To, to go back and strike for yep. things, you know, it's like it's like rewriting the history books when people yep. are like, oh, that person's cancelled. Yeah, you know, that comedy special came out in 1987. Like yep. obviously it was a different time. Yep. You know what I mean? You can't. Yeah. Well, that doesn't doesn't mean it's like appropriate. Well, but you're saying it's yeah. You're saying that it doesn't matter what they said. No, no, well, I agree with what he's saying. I'm yeah. saying like times yeah. change. Something you say in yeah. the 80s was acceptable in the 80s. Eddie anymore. Murphy's delirious. If I were to get up on stage and do that tonight, that would not be good for my career. Right. Yeah. However, that's Iconic. probably one of the greatest comedy specials ever. But like, it's you know, well, it's, yeah. there is some things, terms in it and stuff. You're like, it was a different time. Wasn't you want to get political, Bill? We'll get political. I'm not yeah. getting political. You're getting political. But look, that was a little behind You're the scenes. Look at my cute to... jeans, boy. <laughs> Mm. Come over here. Mm. Stop messing around back there. You know, you, know, you, know, you know the beer. We wanted to share that with you, uh, listening to the off-air pod, just a bit of behind the scenes. Also, uh, I have an order of business, if I may. Yeah, Ben, go for it. I feel like with the uh, show Plints, obviously a lot of hype when we found out we got them. Everyone wants one. It's exciting. But then I feel like if we gatekeep the Plints too hard and we don't ever give them out, then the hype's going to die we'll, down. We'll, we'll end up with, like, a bunch of plinths. Yep. Yeah. So I, I think that we need to have ways to give them away, i.e. I'm doing my AFL Fantasy Challenge. I think there's the, if you recommend a friend to join the Alpha Squad, Andy takes note of your name, that yep. gives you a nomination. I think we, 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 we've got little things in the works, but I want to be guaranteeing we give out one plinth a week. Yeah. One, minimum. one thing, what, I think a good plinth for this week, one thing we haven't done in ages is like a, a show meme competition. Like that's super easy. That's like, so on easy. On the Alpha Squad, yeah. we'll, we'll do a post after this and be like um, all show memes below and the best one in the comments after the weekend. Whoa. Whoa. Who was Whose laptop Who was, was that? that? Yeah. It wasn't mine. That was not mine. Whoa, Liam. Liam. No, I had it up because I was playing Still that like- washing windows. <laughs> people still work for them so much wouldn't we just on a friday in the off air pod like we just go and the plinth this week goes to you know so and so in the off squad who did a great post about this oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. actually i so agree I, I totally agree Bill. But, Good but, idea. but for this week for this week oh, let's do the meme and contest the, ben- the be- best the best plinth spotted <laughs> Maybe one also for the best plinth that was posted that week. I um, oh in the plinth patrol. Yeah, in the pl- plinth patrol. I will no, organise that. Um... <laughs> Just open your mouth when you're talking for us. <laughs> There's so much pressure on your head right now. <laughs> Not strike out. You will... dyslexic f heads every day. Well, you that's say actually stuff wrong. that's actually Deeply learning offensive. a learning disability. So if we're yeah. going to talk about political correctness, I mean, yeah. Uh, I will organise the, the plinth quiz for next week. Everyone was going to do that plinth quiz with the listener that was asking oh, yeah. f- for them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll organise that for next week. All right, right. so plinth, also, plinth oh, yeah. quiz next week and I, meme. Yep, so meme I think just, just to, to really put a line under all of that, I think definitely this week our favourite show meme is going to walk mm-hmm. away with a plinth. And then every week after, when we get to a Friday, yep. I think we go back through the week's worth of alpha posts and our favourite post from that week yeah. is walking away with a plinth. 
One thing I kind of wanted to do as well was just put the phone line in like right now and go first one to call in gets a plinth in the Alpha Squad. What do you mean? Like just put our phone line in the Alpha Squad and say first one to call in on the off-air pod wins a plinth. What? They have so they have they to have guess to when we're recording though. it. No, no, no. I'll like tag at right everyone now. and the first one that sees it and calls in wins a plinth. Let's do that. Let's do that. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully we'll give away a plinth by Hang the end on, of the but episode. Because it's uh, Australia wide, you need to dial the 03 hotline Yeah, yeah. So give us like whatever the hotline. Zero three. This is exciting. Know. We're giving away the hotline First number. one to call into the off-air wins. Uh, Plinth, give me the number. Zero three. Yep. Nine double one seven. Yep. Three nine one zero. This is exciting because the thing with the podcast is it's like recorded and you don't get to be a part of it in that sense. Like yeah. you can obviously comment and get involved, but with the radio show you can call the show up. That's why you know live radio is so good. But this is exciting because it's a podcast, but we're making it interactive. Here yeah. we go. Good Here idea. We go. It's uh, any any second now, I reckon. Uh, I don't think so. That's through. pretty quick. Should we do team member of the week? And if they call whilst we're doing team member of the week, we pick the caller? Yeah. Yeah. I think that sounds good. Uh, yeah. I, I, that's fair. I, I think that's fair. Okay. All, right. All right. Let's kick into it. It's the team member of the week. It'll probably be Ben. All right, guys. Let's get well, yes, this is where we vote on who we feel was the most valuable team member of this given week. Short week, harder to get votes given. Yes, before we get stuck into it, should we talk about the <gasps> post? Call. Whoa! Oh, 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 hey. oh, hang on, hang on. Hello, who's this? Hey, it's uh, Regan from Sydney. Whoa! Oh, Regan! <laughs> Regan, did you see the post in the Alpha Squad? Absolutely. Oh, <laughs> <that is mad. laughs> Regan, that is... What's that, please? <laughs> Someone else actually just called in after, like, seconds There's only after two you. phone lines as well, so if Number anyone else one, is trying baby. now, they won't get through. Who was second in line? What's your name? You're on You're on the podcast. It's Richard. Oh, Richard. <laughs> Richard, you just missed out. Yeah, I heard. I oh, heard. it's so <laughs> brutal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Richard, can we can we sadly let Richard go? I want to see if anyone else is calling through because they can't at the yeah. moment. Richard, oh, I'm sorry, sorry, Richard. Richard. Sorry, Richard. Sorry. Hey, there's Dead a meme. One, please, I'm taking you. <laughs> <laughs> can I just get Andy to say hello, please? There you go. G'day. <laughs> See you, Richard. Thanks, Richard. Have a good one. See you, Richard. That's so brutal. Oh, hopefully, he, hopefully he can get on the meme one. comp later. Oh my god, so many people calling. Hey, uh, you're on the podcast. What's your name? Hey, it's Luke here. How you going? Yeah, good, mate. Sorry, you're the second caller. Oh, you're kidding, no yeah. way. Yeah, sorry, mate. Just wasn't wasn't all quick good, enough. Good. Thanks anyway, dude. See you, mate. Yeah, oh, right, thank you. Yeah, no worries, mate. Left even before he could meet Andy. Uh, I don't think we should take uh, any yeah, more. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't want to keep breaking Regan people's hearts. Regan gets the, the plinth. Congratulations, Can you, Regan. Yeah, well done, Regan. Awesome. Just, uh, just send me a message with your address, mate, and we'll get that plinth to you on, post yeah. haste. Unless Thanks, you're in Andy. Melbourne, you can come pick it up and save us the post. Yeah. Also, also Sydney. can yeah. you comment on that thread and say it's been claimed? Congrats to Regan. Very That's good. That's so funny. The power, the power of the pod. That's awesome. Oh, well, the yeah. power of the Alpha Squad, really. I'd do that once a week. That was, I, fun. That was, <laughs> fun. That was a thrill and a half. Because people will start to know as well, oh, it's around 9.30 on a Friday. Oh, right? yeah. Oh, amazing. Should we now we'll go back to Team Member of the Week? Yeah, let's do yeah, yeah. it. It's the Team Member of the Week. It'll probably be Ben. All right, now, let's get started. Um, Just quickly, yeah. that intro... It sounds like it says, all right, Ben, let's get it started. But it yeah, says, all right, then, yeah, let's right. get it started. Yes. Um, <laughs> there was a post in the Alpha Squad. Are we going to run through the stats? Yeah, we will. Someone, I feel bad for Henrietta, who called that number 25 times. No! And didn't get through. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Henrietta. <laughs> the uh, post is blowing up. Yes, uh, Nathan, God bless, who is the owner of Plin, yep. uh, he uh, has given us... Now, Liam uh, put it into the ether last week <laughs> that he wanted to win team member of the week and Nathan has <laughs> given us some things that have happened since Liam has won uh, team member of the yeah, week right, okay. in the Alpha Squad. Uh, so <laughs> Jerry Springer died. Yeah, well, the, <laughs> the <zap>. Queen died. <laughs> uh, uh, your last win was the 21st of October last year, 27 weeks ago and 17 team member of the weeks ago. Wow. Uh, everyone on the team uh, has won one. Actually, Andy Zito hasn't won a team member of the week. Well, that's, that's a shame as well. He deserves but he was, he, yeah, I, I'm guessing, he, you know, sports bet would have him ahead of you on Ned. <laughs> um, <laughs> Dietrich mates it, so we know that he's won. Uh, we've had 90 normal pod episodes since you've won. That's a lot. 66 off-air pods, 81 hours, 36 minutes, 
and 38 seconds of podcast Whoa. since you've won Jesus. team member of the it's week. It's kind of like um, you know, in the Premier League when like a striker goes through a, a like a dead spell, like a real dry spell, like um, Diogo Jota, and then they they break the deadlock, and then they just can't stop scoring for a few weeks. So I'm ho- I'm hoping once the dam wall breaks, I'll just be like go five for five or something. Right. You know what I mean? Sorry, I lost you for a bit. Before we, we spin the wheel to see who's voting first, yep. do we talk about the elephant in the room, mm-hmm. or do we leave the elephant alone? <laughs> uh, I I simply don't know what anyone's Ooh. referring to. Yeah, I think if the elephant comes up, it comes up. Okay. Uh, We do have the... I'm sure it'll... Let's say this. I'm sure it'll come up. Hang on. The reason that, Andy, we've agreed that we will have everybody in this week for team member is because of the elephant. I don't think so. I think that's just a pure coincidence. Should we get everyone in? Get them in. Yeah, come on in. Come Come on on. in. Yeah, come on. Come on in. Wider team. Producer Brody. Producer Tom. Scudder. Who's up Zito. first? Uh, it's me to vote first, actually. Interesting. I'm going to set the tone here. I mm. will set the tone. Interesting. Uh, I One of my favourite bits, uh, I want to give a shout-out to producer Brody, who mm. killed it with the Jerry Springer uh, yeah, managed, yesterday. Managed to get the guy who you know told us about arse hash. I am going to uh, stop short of voting for Brody, because I think he will potentially get one down the track for that. So I'm going to give my one of my favourite bits of the week, and Liam, front of mind was the uh, thing that we did today where we called the Ringwood, the Australian Hardwood yep. for Ben Singh, which was my idea. So I'm giving myself whoa, whoa, the whoa, nomination whoa, whoa, whoa. for Team Member of the Week. Didn't we, didn't we agree earlier, Andy, that that was a sort of very much like an idea in the ether? Yeah, but I said that so that I could zag and vote for myself at the end. Because <laughs> we, I think it was very much unclear who had the final idea that on that one. It was, it was very much a bell. Myself and Andy brainstorm. I, I, I think when I said the word, should we go call them and pretend to be Ben's manager, that was probably the part where it wow. stopped being a collaborative you just, effort. You just dogged everyone. Yeah, that's, that's a good norm, Andy. That's rough. Uh, who's wow. Next? Well, the the tear pin drop in this room. <laughs> you certainly could. There's a lot of tension. <laughs> oh, it's Tom. Producer Tom, is Tom who next. did an excellent bit this week. I, I don't know if people have worked that out, but Tom is the super fan. Anytime we do that bit with mm. a guest, Tom, you know, he's like, I think you're Luke. Uh, who else yeah, have you been? Yeah, yeah. I was Tristan from Tris- Armadale first. Tristan, Tristan, yeah. yeah. I don't know. Should we do? I think we should keep Tristan from Armadale every time. Also, I was going to say Tristan was I, your best performance. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I, I like Tristan. I really felt. I felt like yeah. Tristan was in my bones. Yeah, 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 yeah. for sure. <laughs> um, okay, so after Nathan starts, yeah. I feel like it's a kind of a pity vote, but I you feel like I have to vote. give it no. to Andy Zito. <laughs> <laughs> I feel I didn't realise that there was someone on the team that hadn't yes. won yet, so I feel like they deserve it. Yeah, I've won uh, since uh, I've known you, Tom. I don't think it's a pity vote. I think it's a body of work vote. <laughs> Thank okay. You. Well, Thank yeah, you. yeah, Andy's done some good stuff yeah. on the socials this week. You get enough small wins. Oh, yeah, Andy's up. done great work, I'm yeah. just saying. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> uh, oh, it's very close, but Ben is going to be the next one. Wow. To vote. Uh, pretty simple for me. Um... This person, Mr. Consistent, always turning it on. <laughs> uh, and it's kind of been touched on already this morning, um, but my vote is going to go to Brody for getting the producer of the Jerry Springer show. That was probably that was the great. highlight of the week for me. Got it in the space of, what, half an hour? Yeah. Amazing. Yeah, yeah. Amazing. That was a good one. <laughs> Where are we at? <laughs> well, you've um, got one, Andy Zito's got one, and Brody's, Brody's got, got one. Brody, here we go. The Brody. Na- the Navi himself, Brody. Big is Navi. Step up to the plate. Also, I don't know if you saw on the App Squad this week that you were... Um, or was that a DM? That someone, was a DM, yeah, someone yeah. called us out. They're like, yeah, nice one. That guy suggesting Warren oh, yeah. for Ben's baby name obviously produced Brody. <laughs> you, you, can't put, you can't pull the wool over. And like, honestly, it's, it's impressive when like, obviously we know your voice because yeah. that you're always on. But now I think we've, you know, revealed the wizard's curtain and we've said, yeah, sometimes, you know, yeah. there are fake callers. Um, yeah, you get <laughs> stuff like that. Can I just, just for my own benefit, all the ones this morning, the wedding ones, they were all real. All yeah. real. Yeah, good. Okay. All yeah, genuine. Good. Yeah, that's good. Hello, Narvies. I would... <laughs> like to nominate this week for a point deduction 
Wait, oh, what? Jesus what? Christ. Hang on. Such a, that such is, a thing ever happened? So, I suppose you can get that. This is rewrite. <laughs> made his own rule. This rewrites the rule book, but I suppose I'm looking I'm looking through and there is there is no rule that uh, says you can't uh, you're ahead of so time. You just we hate might someone this So hang on, rather than doing a nomination, you can take a point off someone. Because that actually changes the game because you know it's always like oh, yeah. obviously Ben's one yeah. because you know statistically yeah. but if like if someone deducts a point, then it could go down <laughs> like to a you know, I love that. Somewhere in the future, Nathan Jander's just fainted. <laughs> <laughs> For my point deduction, I would like to nominate Ben. Whoa. Whoa. After yeah. showing us photos of your lamb shoulder that you cooked yes. and so yeah. perfectly mastered, yep. yeah. you said, I will bring some in to show. You did oh, say oh, that. Oh, did, and did. you did not bring any in to show or to try. I, and for that, I'd yep. like to deduct a point. I'll it's cop that on the chin. I'll cop already, that on the so chin. Ben's ben on minus one. So yes, yeah, so Andy, Andy, one each with Brody, and Ben's on minus one. Liam's on zero. <laughs> What do you, what do you, there's a lot of people in the room that so are on zero. I don't well, know. Yeah. I don't want to bog the podcast down. Uh, speaking of Andy Zito, you're up to vote. Well, hi. Well, I thought that I was going to vote for Brody this morning for wrangling that amazing Jerry Springer yeah, chat. Yeah. And, like, you yeah. know, but I'm actually going to vote for Brody for inventing the negative point deduction. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. Really good nom. Good. That's, that's a good inspired. Point, Zito. Inspired. It's good. Good nom. It's Very good. good. Changes everything. <laughs> Liam, Scudder, and Bell to vote, and it's going to be Bell. Uh, I would like to give a nom for something that um, happened this morning as soon as we came into work. It was uh, beautiful, beautiful. The the show kicked off, and it was already a fantastic feeling because Brody got the producer of Jerry Springer. So my vote goes to him. <laughs> well done, Brody. So happy for you, dude. So happy. I would say Brody, Brody traditionally at this stage couldn't be caught, but now, yeah, the, now, now is there, point could point in, there could be two deductions. In theory, you could lose, but doesn't seem likely. Uh, Liam and Scudder, yep. and it's going to be the Meister, Scudder. <laughs> <laughs> you couldn't write this any better. I, uh, I actually had who I was going to vote for earlier yep. in the week. Yep. Um, this person's had an amazing week. Um like really good ideas all week and then uh, I rocked up to my office this morning and um, it was just a bit of a it was a bit of a stink in there of of desperation mm. oh. like it's just as soon as I walked in so I'm not going to vote for that person anymore yep. uh, in fact I'm going to vote uh, for Andy Zito hey. 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 <laughs> so hang on so Zito Two, and two. Brody's on Brody three. three. So yep. it kind of comes down to Liam, I guess. Uh, yeah. If he <laughs> is <go>. indeed next. <laughs> uh, yep. It's spinning, spinning around and around she goes. Yes, Where she is. stops, nobody knows. Well, Liam, yeah. you're up. There you go, I'm voting. Jeez, I mean, there's so many people this week, isn't there? Because, you know, as statistically, I'm, I'm the most generous, um, you know, vote giver. I mean, I, I've been, I spent like probably $200 on Ubers this week just to get to work. My car's been stuck <laughs> That's here. That's your own fault. Um, That's no, your no, own fault. No, 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 no. But one person actually offered to drive me in, and that was um, Andy, even though he's further away than, you know, the rest of you. But obviously, that doesn't matter. Um... You know, I, and I could, you know, give myself another self nom because I don't know. Like on Monday, I asked what everyone's favourite chocolate bar is, and then went out and bought them. And then on Friday, I put oh, everyone's favourite chocolate bar on there. Yeah, is that did. why there was chocolate oh, bars on all that desk? Yeah. Yeah. No yeah. idea, but that was good. Yeah. yeah. Is that why Scudder's audio booth smelt like desperation? Yeah, yeah. Or, or maybe, or maybe it's because you know, on Sunday, I you know gave up my weekend by myself, went and hung out with four or five listeners, which seemed to go under the radar. Part which, of your job. Yeah. I went to live golf for the show. You didn't. There was f- all about that on the show. <laughs> and you, can, you, you can tell. You can tell. I'm starting to get agitated because I feel like this is an inside job. I reckon there's a group chat that I'm not in, and, you, and all you pricks got together and said purposely we're going to do a bit where we what. don't vote for f- Liam again. <laughs> and so I don't know what I'm going to have to do. I don't know if it's going to be sexual favors next week. I've already given everyone favorite chocolate, but obviously that didn't work. So I'm just going to vote for Brody because well done. He got the Jerry Springer thing. It was pretty damn good. Yeah. Yeah. And I'll give a, I'll give an honorable mention to Scudder who's going to bleep at least six fucks out of this podcast. Oh. Are you mad about the chocolate bar thing, man? I think he's mad at the chocolate bar. Thing. I don't want to play I into just your hands. Never put the chocolate bar thing together. I didn't there realize that's what you were doing. 
Yeah. You guys suck. Like if that. I had have put that together, <laughs> I would, I would nice. have voted for Liam. In it makes theory. sense now. Like you were asking everyone's favorite chocolate bar, yeah. and then it came in on a Friday. Such a nice thing to do. You would think front of mind. I mean, t- producer Tom's favorite is a peppermint crisp. They're not easy to find. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? They're, yeah, I know they're not, mate. I went to three shops looking for one. You if prick. You, you know the moment <laughs> you did that, you lost everyone's vote. <laughs> <laughs> what have you had anyone since the end of October, Bill? I don't know. You know, just forget about it. I'm not even going to try anymore. I might not even come in next week. <laughs> no, no, I'm just not valued here. <laughs> All right. Is that the end? I think that's yeah, the end. Yeah, All right. Plinth. 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 I hope you enjoyed your chocolates. <laughs> you didn't say plinth. Oh, yeah. Plinth. <laughs>